Hi, I'm Timmy the Star. And I'm looking to find a new galaxy to go to. There's so many different galaxies. How am I supposed to know which one to go to? Things to know about all the different stars and the galaxies. There are three different kinds of galaxies. The spiral galaxy, the irregular galaxy, and the elliptical galaxy. The spiral galaxy is similar to the, our galaxy, the Milky Way galaxies. Spiral galaxies have a bulge at the center and spiral arms. The spiral arms are made up of gas, dust, and new stars. Irregular galaxies have no definite shape. The smallest galaxies only have about 10 million stars, but the largest ones have around several billion stars. Irregular galaxies form new stars slowly. Some form when galaxies collide. Elliptical galaxies are one of the largest galaxies in the universe. They can contain up to 5 trillion stars and can also be thought of as cosmic snowballs. Unlike spiral galaxies, whose clouds are still forming stars, elliptical galaxies seem to have stopped making new stars more than 10 billion years ago. And also, unlike the Milky Way galaxy, which is in a spiral galaxy, the elliptical galaxy has no arms. Galaxies are made up of many different stars with many different sizes. Most of the stars are in the main sequence that come together and form a band that runs across the HR diagram. The blue stars are the hottest and the red stars are the coolest. As stars, as stars age, they move up to the right on the HR diagram and become giants or supergiants. Then they move to the left and become white dwarfs. At the end of a star's life, if it's big enough, a gigantic explosion will happen that makes the star collapse and throw all its outer layers into space. This is, this is called a supernova. One more question. Are stars really shaped like me? Pause the screen and think about it. Just think about it. No, they're not shaped like me. Stars in real life are actually circular. So, see you guys later. I'm going to join, join my friends now.